Here we have the probably version two of my Axon from Experimental Airlines. Loved the original after having a few crashes with it. Really, only hard landings actually. I decided to take another stab at it. We're using the rudder and elevator from the original build as well as the V2 wing from the original build. I have redone the fuselage. This time, instead of using the curved fuselage tube, I'm now using more of the score and bend tube, as you can see here. More of the score and the bend. I reinforced the sidewall to be a little more strong in landings. I've cut the taper, but I've sealed over and created a hatch to the front here. Good access to the battery compartment below. The fuselage tube is also a little more narrow than it had been previously. Better mounting the battery, I created this battery tray, kind of a sliding tray mechanism, and got the idea from Newton Airlines to do this softer foam nose. This I think will be great for impact protection should there be any. So it's kind of a combination of tips and techniques that I got both from Experimental Airlines as well as Newton Airlines. Let's take a look how she flies.
Ugh. Bit of a hard landing. Let's check it out and see what happened. All right, the tape broke on the wing. Ah, oh, this new nose configuration. Fantastic. Look at that. Look at that, just the slightest dimple in the foam, and that was a nose down crash. Beautiful. Wow. All right, a bit. Nope, that's where I sealed it. Wonderful, the only thing that happened was the tape joining the wing. <laughs> I got that on video. Let's see what we got. We got one elastic, two elastic, three elastic. We got three elastics. Where's the last? Here we go. Four elastics. Ugh.